like you could write a poem by Zach Taylor. Woo! I don't know if it was because of the book you were reading or if it was because of the curvature of your sloped spine. Intuited, you were tired. Or maybe it was because you looked lonely, but you looked like you could write poetry. It could have been the pen marks on your fingers or the tan lines across your neck, but eyes like that don't just sit down. Eyes like that start fires in my cheeks and picket signs in my chest and piss off legislators, but more importantly, they make me want to write. I don't know if it was the way your jaw pinched you or the way your tongue bit your teeth, but you looked like you could recite poetry. And even worse, I wanted to listen. I wanted to be your committee, outreach, moral support. I wanted to be your pen and paper, microphone, clothes on your back. I wanted to be anything that touched your skin, touching me. Your least favorite feeling is when you're holding back tears and your face is about to explode. There are reasons why the clouds look so heavy before falling. God can't hold so much in. You said you don't believe in luck, but you're a firm believer in hope. The tree leaf clovers weren't done growing when you were plucked. When a ladybug didn't land on your hand, a premature baby somewhere is using his grasp on his mother's finger for the first time. I want to hear poetry that you'll write about me, about the spaces between your fingers. It will be the closest I'll ever get to holding them. You were born an angry baby with tears in your eyes that I use to poetry to say they weren't angry, just eyes dancing.